prey are often able to get away from their predators, and today will be kind of like that too, but with the prey escaping one hungry predator, and as soon as they start celebrating, as soon as they start to feel a sigh of relief, another predator comes out of nowhere and takes them down. Guys, please help me out by liking this video, as it really makes a difference. Also subscribe if you want to see more crazy videos. Let's get going. Let's start with a slow moving but armored tortoise getting attacked by a jackal. The jackal tried to get in there through the hole as it could not break the shell and when it got tired of trying, it just pees on the turtle so nobody else could eat it. But then came the honey badger, one of the most fearless animals in the world and pee isn't going to stop him and neither is the hard shell. The honey badger actually manages to break the shell and gets right into it and starts eating the turtle from the inside out. It's like being barricaded in your house, watching a freaking bear trying to slowly get in and it eventually does. A leopard snuck up on a herd of impalas at the watering hole and it was able to get one down and was about to take it up a tree to get away from other predators, but then a hyena rushed in. The leopard let go of it real quick and it escaped and the impala was free and it started to run away as fast as it could also. Unlucky though, the hyena chased after it and although we can't see what happens in the bushes, later on when the hyena comes out, it has blood all over its face, so it actually killed the injured deer and came back to the watering hole just to wash it down. This deer was surrounded by the most aggressive predators in the world, the African wild dogs. It would fight off the dogs and then they started to back off, so it thought that maybe they were leaving, but then out of nowhere, the freaking hyenas would come in <laughs> and it would do its best to try to keep him off him as well. He even headbutted one knocking it down. The dogs and the hyenas would trade off attacks. The deer thought many times that it had gotten rid of one of the predators, but then the other one would come from the other side, until eventually it made the mistake of committing too much to attacking a single hyena, and that's when it got swarmed and killed. <laughs> this poor deer was just trying to get a drink of water at the local watering hole, when it got snuck up on by a crocodile. The weird part is that it seems like the crocodile came up from behind, from the grass, then it dragged it into the water. Luckily for this impala, the croc was on the smaller side, so after battling for minutes, it managed to get free. But this is the local watering hole, and other predators know to hunt here too. It just finished drying itself off, trying to compose itself after having a literal battle for life and death, but it still somehow had the energy to try and run away. Unfortunately, the leopard did catch it and had it for a meal. This house cat was able to get this baby rabbit while out patrolling his backyard, but he just played with him for too long. The rabbit might have been playing dead, so when he was freed for just a second, he got his ass in gear and made a run for it, with a cat in hot pursuit. But the other predator in the scene was high up, just watching for the cat to make one single mistake. That freaking cat got scared as shit, and also in the face of pure shock, he was going to get the rabbit real quick, but with the owl coming down, he quickly changed directions. Then he's just standing there wondering, where the hell did that thing come from? These poor zebras have to cross this river every year, and every year the crocodiles are waiting patiently for the feast of the year. But now, there are other predators who have realized this, and have come down to get an easy meal. This video is freaking insane. The zebra barely escapes the river with its foal, but it's badly injured. I'm not sure it would have survived, but out of nowhere comes a leopard that just has its food served on a rocky platter. Then crazily enough, the croc was pretty angry about its dib not being respected. This massive crocodile tried to go up there and get it back, but with no luck. 
it just couldn't get its massive weight over the rocks, and its jaws couldn't wrap around that tasty ass. The leopard didn't even care, it just kept eating. This one is plain strange. You have some wild African dogs about to kill this antelope. They had it dead to rights, but out of nowhere comes this massive hippo and scares them away. Good for the antelope. The antelope then tries to make you run for it, but jumps right into the mud river. There wasn't really anywhere else where it could go, but then it got stuck. The dogs didn't let up, they kept trying to get it, and that's when the hippo, who was at first the hero, now turned into the second villain of the story. The male hippo seemed to just get tired of the dogs and antelope invading his space, so he just finished the job and killed the antelope, and just threw it to the dogs, like humans throwing some meat to their dogs. It was freaking crazy how fast he turned from friend to foe. A python saw a baby impala just resting by itself, and it made a move to hunt it down. The deer almost got away, it was getting up, ready to run. The hyena got in the way of the baby deer possibly getting out of the stranglehold, and that's when the snake was able to get it fully wrapped. The hyena at one point even tries to just carry both the snake and the deer away, but he got scared so it dropped them. Oh, it's still alive. Oh, oh. Look, he's just taking it. Eventually the snake finished the job, but with the hyena being there, it couldn't just eat the deer, so it let it go and just left it there for the hyena. This scavenger just takes somebody else's hard work and claims it for himself. Again, with those poor zebras having to cross those crocodile infested waters. This time, the zebra made it out completely unscathed after escaping from two crocs. It's fantastic. Wow. But then, you have the pride of lions just waiting for some opportunity, and luckily the zebra just walks right up to them. Oh my goodness. This is the paradise pride. They're killing a zebra live on the balloon. The zebra actually sensed them right after making it to the top of the hill, but it couldn't see them, so it just started running in any direction. Unfortunately, it was right to them. This one actually had the chance to be completely uninjured, but it just had terrible luck. Just in case you didn't know, there are flying fish, and as they are being hunted underwater by a huge Dorado fish, they take to the skies to escape. Escape seems impossible. These fish can actually glide for 100 meters with a good gust of wind, but as soon as they escape the predators below, from above come the frigate birds to take them down. The frigate birds have been waiting for them. These fish evolved to escape the predators in the ocean, only to have the flying predators take them out in the air. What shitty luck. How must it be to have this terrible luck? It's like getting fired from your job, but luckily you have another one lined up ready to go. But then you get home to find your wife getting railed by your best friend. There's just no winning. Thanks for watching this video. See you next time.